Assalamu alaikum fam. Hope you're doing well. So, just want to say how much I appreciate the masculine men in society who are doing their best to uphold our civilization and who have helped our species survive. I know it's difficult for many masculine men who enjoy women being wives and who enjoy providing for their families. I understand how difficult it is for you right now. How much propaganda is aimed at you. How many temptations and traps are set up for you. How you're ridiculed, abused, taunted, tempted, shamed. And how many attempts are made to push you off of that guardian position of humanity. But I want you to know that I appreciate you and that many other women appreciate you as well. And that I won't stop fighting for you and for your recognition. And I really hope that in your soul you know that you're valued, even if the media, the marketing, the leftists, and others try to degrade you, corrupt you, shame you, and degrade your soul, and to pull you into hellfire with them. Just want you to know that you are a special generation that has existed on this earth because you are really up against the wall. You're facing the digital temptations. You're facing organized efforts, both spiritual and political, ideological and economic. And I want you to know that your suffering will help you to earn paradise, inshallah, and to keep going, don't lose hope, and don't become too cynical, and don't think that you're not noticed. It's up to you to help us. It's up to you to help us women to be safe. It's up to you to fight off the gangs and the cartels, to help the lost boys, to preserve your daughters and raise them well. It's up to you to pick good women and neglect the bad women. Through your patriarchal system, we can get the gender roles back to what they're supposed to be. And I salute you and I am proud of you. All of you who are trying your best against very tough odds. And if some of you haven't shared your tips with the young men, I really encourage you to do so because they need you. If you don't show them, someone else will show them and that will not be according to what Allah Aswaja wants. It's up to you to have this tremendous task. This tremendous task of guarding women, protecting young men, helping people to be married. If you're a good brother, have a second, third, fourth wife to produce children. To work hard and when you're at work, resist kafir women who would seek to destroy you, tempt you, bring you down in the terms of how Allah would be pleased with you. You have immense pressure on you. And it's really sad that there are other Muslim women who desire to take the side of the seculars and the liberals against you. I understand that it's very popular now for the infighting, but you have to be steadfast. And you have to know that you're valued and that the battle of front today is happening excessively in the digital sphere and on the streets where you give dawah and economic traps. So keep strong, keep going forward and know that many women support you and that many women pray for you and that you're needed and valued and preserve yourself, preserve yourself and endure all your tests and trials. You will become stronger inshallah, but society needs you you uphold it through your shoulders, and I really hope that you make it and that you can protect us women and don't let the corrupt, weaker men to get in positions of authority and to hold yourselves accountable and to help weaker men not get into the positions of authority that will ruin and corrupt society. Help men to do, be to do better and to do well and keep going. 
never tire and keep your feet firm and your morals high. Learn from your mistakes and share your wisdom. May all preserve you.